Hi guys, Lexi here with Tutorial QTXOX. Today in GIMP I'm going to be showing you a really, really simple way how to remove wrinkles and make the skin look airbrushed. The airbrush is the same as I did the other video. Um, basically just using the clone tool and then the smudge tool. Um, but what you want to do first just to remove wrinkles is click on the clone tool, which is right here. Uh, or, um, yes, and you want to control click on a spot near the wrinkle. That does not is not actually a wrinkle though, and then click on the wrinkle, and you'll see right here it gets rid of it. Um, so that's basically what you want to do if you're trying to get rid of wrinkles. It's a really simple way to do this, um, but you can just slide it up and down, and it's really not that hard. Um, make sure um, when you're clicking to remove the wrinkle, like control clicking, it has to be near the wrinkle. Otherwise the skin tones might not match like that. Um, didn't work too well. Um, but yes, yeah, so that's basically just um, how you remove wrinkles. Um, you guys can play around with this a bit. See if you find another way to do this, but this is probably, I think, the simplest way I've figured out to do this. So... Um, there might be another way that I don't know about, but, um, yeah, that's just basically it. So you can see it looks a little bit better, um, but that's pretty much how you do it. So thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and request.